You want to play Pokemon Tournament? Just like you're seeing on screen, easily and smoothly on your phone, without any lag or problems. But you can't, because most tutorials don't explain it well or are more annoying than your ex. Then this video is for you. I'm going to show you how to download, install, and configure the Eden emulator, and of course, how to add your games so you can play Pokemon Tournament, just like you see here, without dying in the process. All you have to do is follow my steps carefully until the end of the video. You'll see how in less than 7 minutes, I'll teach you how to set up and play it on your Android. Alright, without wasting more time, let's jump into the tutorial. First, we're going to open the Play Store and look for an app called ES File Manager. This app will make everything much simpler because I don't like complications. So we search for it. It's always the first result. Then install it and wait for it to download. Once it's done, open it. Now, grant all the necessary permissions. We've done this many times, so you already know how it goes. After that, go to internal storage, tap the three dots, select new folder, and name it 001. Nintendo Switch Games, exactly like I'm typing it. You'll see later why we do this. It's just to stay organized, so follow every step carefully. Once the folder is created, go to the Downloads folder. You'll recognize it by the arrow pointing down. Open it. Cut all the files you downloaded and paste them into the folder we just created. Now we're going to install the Eden emulator. You'll notice that we already have everything we need. The firmware and the keys. I'll leave all the download links in the pinned comment. If you made it this far, I recommend you subscribe to the channel, turn on the bell, and comment below how it worked for you. I'll reply personally. Open the emulator, grant all the permissions, tap the big button and continue. Then tap the X, open the three lines menu and look for your device's root directory. That's your phone's name. The first folder you'll see is the one we created earlier, which is why we named it like that. Next, let's load the firmware, look for it the same way. Once that's done, it's time for the games. You'll see a folder called Games. Go back to the root directory, select your phone name, find the folder 001, tap Yes, and continue. Now comes one of the most important steps. Tap the gear icon and open the CPU driver manager. Tap fetch and then look for Game Hub Adreno 8 XX. That's the recommended one. Find in the list, tap download and wait for it to finish. Note that download time depends on your internet speed. Once it's done, that's it. You're ready to play. Go back, open your game, and it should run perfectly. Alright my friends, that's it for today. I hope you liked the video. I'm signing off, but not before reminding you 
If you're new here, subscribe, turn on the bell, and leave a comment telling me how it worked for you. I'll reply personally. I'll leave you with some Pokemon tournament gameplay. And as always, see you next time, friends. <laughs>